Hey guys, it's Rita Math Person. Today I'll be going over question 38 on SO exam P. So pause the video real quick and try to palm yourself. Okay, assuming you already attempted it, let's just dive right in. So this question is asking, calculate the probability that that, that is insured for less than two years. So X is less than two years, given that X is insured for at least 1.5. So by the conditional probability formula, we can break this down into the probability that X is between 1.5 and 2 divide by the probability that x is greater than 1.5. Alright, alright. Then this is not too bad. The denominator is going to be... Actually, I think it's going to be easier to do probability of 1 minus probability that x is less than 1.5 because this goes on from 1 to infinity. And then I always like it better when I integrate it from 0. <laughs> Just makes the number a little bit easier. So th I'm going to work on the denom denominator first. The probability that x is less than 1.5 is just going to be from 1.5 less than that number starting at 1 so it's going to be from 1 to 1.5 and this goes on for infinity by the way of this function here 3x to negative 4 dx when you do the antiderivative you add 1 so negative 3 divide by that number so integrating from 1 to 1.5 upper limit is going to give you a negative 1.5 to the negative 3 plus 1 so then this is equal to approximately equal to 0 0.7037. Well, we know we have to do 1 minus the number. So 1 minus 0 0.7037 is equal to 0.29629. So that's the denominator. And now we have to find it, the probability that it's between 1.5 and x. I mean, and 2. <laughs> so that's not too bad. So this is going from 1.5 to 2 of the same function we just integrated, 3x to negative 4 dx. Taking this it's going to give you the same thing, negative x, negative 3. It's just that we're integrating from a different range now, going from 1.5 to 2. Upper limit here is going to give you negative 2 to the negative 3, minus minus 1.5 to the negative 3. So this is equal to 0.17129. Okay, so now we have everything we need. Denominator we figured out was this here, 0 0.29629. Numerator we said was this here, 0 0.17129, 0 0.17129. So we gotta plug it that into the calculator, and you get 0 0.57812, which is equal to 0.578. Our answer A. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye.